Um, my son Alex, who's 15, was diagnosed with um, osteosarcoma back in March this year. Hi, I'm Matt Lewis and in 2009 I was diagnosed with human sarcoma. Hello, my name is Katie Bruman. I was diagnosed with osteosarcoma in February 2007. Well, I've uh, been to every single BCLT conference. I came to the first one back in 2007 um, whilst I was being treated. In fact, I just literally had an operation two weeks before um, and I was determined to go to the conference and I can honestly say that, that going to that first conference has changed my life. Obviously, you know, it's been a, a massive shock to us all, um, his diagnosis and, and the intensive treatment that he's currently ongoing, is, is currently ongoing. So I thought it would be a good opportunity to come along and network with um, the medical professionals and also other sort of parents who are going through a similar situation. It gives me the opportunity to meet the patients and meet the families of the patients and listening to their sort of stories, you walk away inspired to do more. I congratulate you all for being here. You are taking an active role in your recovery. All of you sitting in the audience are here because you have decided to do something positive about the fact that you or someone you love has been affected by this disease. My philosophy was to keep my life as normal as possible. I never felt resentful or thought, why has this happened to me? I think I was able to get myself well because of a combination of three things. The excellent specialist care I received in hospital, my own determination to get better and the love and support of friends and family. I find it uh, warm to come here really to experience and see what others are seeing as well and uh, I find great benefit in that. Also gives me a bit more knowledge of what's happening within research etc within the BCRT. Um, BCRT is such a huge and important part of my life now and who I am. Um, I absolutely love everything this conference stands for and the charity um, and meeting other families and people that have been through this experience is just absolutely invaluable and um, the support um, that you get coming to a conference is just second to none and I really would recommend it to everybody going through primary bone cancer. Well the benefits for myself are, are actually meeting patients in a non-clinical setting. Here I'm meeting a whole group of people all of whom are interested in improving outcomes for everyone with bone cancers. Throughout the treatment, the days when I had good days, I marvelled, lapping up and appreciating every part of it. I have met amazing people and above all, I have been given the opportunity today to help make a difference. Um, I've had some really inspiring um, personal experiences from other young people who've been through um, bone cancer. It came to me very loud and clear that I needed to speak and help others to keep positive and to always focus on the best outcome. I needed to keep Sachs' spirit and that of all the fighters out there amongst you alive. I've also recently been talent spotted at Paralympic Potential Day in Iceland, Jockey and Athletics. I start my training next week and my plan now is to excel in the sports and start my career in charity. Thank you for listening.